Hi guys, I'm here with Emma Bunton. Hello. Hello. Emma. Emma's going to impart you. lovely to see you, and Emma's going to impart a bit of uh, her parenting <gasps> knowledge with us. I've got oh. a few <laughs> few questions here. Okay. Because you've got um five year old boy and a nine year old boy. I have. You? Yes. Double trouble. A double trouble. Yes. <laughs> So, are you a strict parent, Emma, or do you go with the flow? Um, I, I think it's about having balance. Um, I'm a bit, I, I love cuddles. So, I wouldn't say, I, I, I would say my other half, Jade, is stricter than I am. Oh, really? Yeah. Is it good cop, bad cop? Uh, not really. We try. We really try and balance everything out. But, yeah. Um, but actually, they're quite good. So... Fingers crossed. I'm sure I'll have to be a bit strict as they get older. But you've got good boys at the <laughs> moment. they're good boys at the moment. <laughs> Can you remember the last time you had a lion? No! <laughs> I really can't. Over, over nine years ago, I suspect. Way over now, yeah. And also because I do my heart breakfast show, so I'm up oh, before course, my oh, children. Yeah. And then the weekends is, is quite special to us, so we all get up really early, have breakfast oh. together. Yeah, so I'd love a lion. Would though. you? We could have, well, do you know what? We've got Mother's Day coming nice. up, so you might have answered that question. What would you love for Mother's I Day? I would love a lion. Are you please? listening? Yes. <laughs> Not a bagel with orange juice that's poured all over it by the time it gets no, to me. You know, no. that's what will probably happen. Yeah. If you, but if a bit of a lion. Up biscuits, <laughs> yeah. a cold tea. Yeah. Um, what's the worst bit of parenting advice you've ever received? Oh my goodness. The worst. Or the best, if that's too hard. The best was definitely from my mum when I was pregnant because I'm a bit of a worrier uh, and I'm all, I, I worry about everything, you know, Aww. so um, she was brilliant when I was pregnant, I would worry whether, the, obviously it's just a constant thing, is the baby okay and what am I, am I eating the right things, so she just said to me, stop putting pressure on yourself, you are doing everything possible to keep your baby safe. Can you remember your most awkward or embarrassing parenting moment? Oh, well, it has to be. I'm sure we've all been there, kind of the tantrum moment when it happens in the supermarket yeah. and you're like, oh, I'm not sure what to do. Oh, That is horrible, isn't it? But luckily, I was with my mum and he calmed down quite quickly. But, um, yeah, I found him up the skirt of one of the mannequins. Oh, no, yeah. So, <laughs> that's quite embarrassing. As long as he's not still doing that when he's 15. No, <laughs> that would be a bit embarrassing. Um, can you remember the last kids' film that made you cry? Oh, Moana. Oh, yes, it's Moana good, Moana was it? the film that made yeah, me cry. Yeah, the music's good. Absolutely loved it. I went to the cinema three times to see okay. it with my little boy. <laughs> uh, yeah, we love that film. And uh, on another film thing, are you going to be taking them to see Beauty and the Beast? Absolutely. In fact, I have got a bit, I feel a bit awful about this. So it was out this weekend. Yes. I completely forgot and said, oh, we're going to go next weekend because it was a bit busy. And I said, it's not out until next weekend. Oh, you can't no. see it. And of course, we saw Everybody. some friends who had seen, seen it, it the... and I was like, no, no, it's out next week. And oh, I feel a bit terrible. But anyway, we'll, we'll go next we will. week. We will. the pledge. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> well, Emma, thank you so much for taking time to talk to us. It was a pleasure. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, bye guys. Bye.